guys, thanks so much for joining me again today for another December daily process video. So for today I've got day 21 for you, um, so December 21st. Uh, today is going to be a relatively simple one once again. Um, so uh, we were still on holiday, so we were in Bali um, during December. And so we decided to go and get some ice cream. Uh, it was a relatively warm night. So we thought, you know, we'd get something kind of, you know, sugary and fun. So we just decided to, to get some ice cream and look for something a bit more Christmassy um, to, um, to to try. So we went to Baskin Robbins and so we just had some ice cream and I essentially just talk about, you know, what we enjoy that day and, you know, what happened, I guess. And so I printed out a photo, so a 4 by 6 photo, which goes on the top there. And I also decided to use this piece of this round die cut piece, which is from the Aliquid's um, December Daily main kit. And now I'm just thinking about what I want to do with to try and create the word um, 21st to more well, 2 1 really. And so I'm just kind of thinking, moving around and seeing which one, you know, which style I prefer. And so I decided to actually create my own kind of 4x6 journaling card. I have to admit, we didn't get that many 4x6. 4x6 journaling cards from the Alley Roots main kit. So I thought I'd create my own. I pull out this piece of pen paper which is from the Hip Kick Club's November kit. So I believe it's actually from Crate Paper if I'm not wrong. So I just cut out in 4x6 and then use a blank piece of white cardstock to add. So I decided to have a bit of space on the top, along the top there so that it kind of looks like it, it's, um, so I can put a title on it, so 21st. And I, my aim was to make sure that at least the, the gutter on the left and on the right and on the bottom will be of the same size. And then I am going to add that circle that says um, celebrate this on the on the top there just to kind of add a little bit of interest and we'll add that um, halfway between the the photo on the top and the bottom and now I'm thinking what I want to add or you know add the word 21 and what 21st or 21 and I'm just thinking I want something quite simple on this page and not nothing to you know um, you know, dark or, or bold or anything like that. So I'm just sticking that down and kind of trying to make sure that there's kind of the space is even. And I am also sticking down this circle here, which is kind of a gold embossed circle. And my aim was to make sure that the word celebrate is on the top and then the, um, the word this is at the bottom and there's no kind of you know, it's not in the middle of what I had to cut. And then I'm using these alphabet stickers from the from the December Daily main kit. So you get a set of these. And I'm just spelling out the word 21st. I am trying to make sure that I kind of, well, trying to make sure that the word would fit in that space. So I'm putting that on the, on the side of a bag, like a plastic bag that that, um, that after the stickers um, set, well, the, the set came in. And the reason I am doing that is largely, sometimes I just put the stickers on the page straight away. Um, but when it comes down to things that are kind of really quite um, fragile, like, you know, these really small stickers, I try to, you know, make sure that I put it on a, you know, somewhere else, like, you know, a, a, a piece of plastic first, um, largely because these stickers are easier to move if they're on, you know, a piece of plastic. They're a bit more, por they're a bit more, um, I guess, slick and so easier to pull out. And now I am going to try to put that on directly onto the page there. And I'm just spelling the word 20. And then I have kind of an asterisk in the middle and then I write the word first and just trying to stick that down. It's actually one of those processes is just taking a long time because you kind of if you're really kind of careful about it or you, you know you care about it being really even it takes quite a while and you know 
going it takes yeah it takes a long time so and now I'm thinking do I want to add something else so you know I'm thinking mm, not sure the next thing I'm doing here is I am going to be adding my journaling so I typed out for some of you this is your first video watching um, uh, my process so I tend to type out my journaling during the month uh, I, I you know I do the I scrap afterwards um you know just in January but I tend to try to write something down you know just something down during December largely because I some I often I don't I, I tend to forget you know what um what actually happened and you know if you ask me now you know what actually happened I probably can't well I, I can probably tell that we were in Baskin Robbins but that was essentially it would I remember I wouldn't remember what we actually had you know what flavor and those kind of things so I try to write that down during December so I, I you know that so I can actually write it down when I I do scrap the page and so what did I say I said um. We went to dinner, we went out for dinner and on the way back we went to this shopping centre near the hotel and we had two, what they call it, two scoops a day. It's one is a chocolate, peanut butter and the other one is a super strawberry. They're both really delicious and we also got two cherries on top which is really cool. And so I've also added that piece of chipboard, that star chipboard there which is along the top there which is from the Alleywoods. Um, um, main kit and I decided to also add these enamel dot instead of the on top of the asterisk there that was um, separating the 20 and first. So here are some close up you guys. Thanks so much for joining me again today and I hope to see you again tomorrow. If you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up so I know you enjoyed it. Bye!